Hey, hello, Lisa and Debbie, Paul McLean here, Crestview RV, Buda, Texas. Thank you for your time today. Uh, we just got off text. I know you guys are on your way in, but I'm going to shoot the video for you anyway. This is the one you're about to see in person, close and personal. This is, I think it's a 2021. It's the 195 RB. I went through it pretty thoroughly. Uh, nothing that I hate about it. It's pre-owned, but it looks super clean. It'll go through about three hours in the detail shop before you come and do your overnight with it if you decide to do that, um, or at least do your orientation class with your technician. But everything seems to be good to go. I tried to hook it up to my battery, but I failed. So I was gonna try to put the awning out for you and everything, but I'm not able to. My battery must be messing up. But let's take a look inside. Might be a little dark in here. Or a lot dark, I can't tell. But yeah, it's got the bed that you like, the north-south. It's got a uh, probably a 15K single dump AC. It has the same refrigerator as that bunkhouse version that we liked before finding out we had this one. If I can get some more light in here, maybe. There we go, maybe. So 110 outlets on either side of your bed stands. A little bit of hanging space on each side. And I think it's an aftermarket um, mattress. It's a Serta mattress. I don't think they put Sertas in here from the get-go, but they might. These windows open up 50% for you, so you can get a good breeze going through here. AM, FM radio, which is on somehow. So that means I have battery battery. That's odd. My portable battery didn't do anything. Microwave, two burner stove, furnace, and fuse box. Lots of pantry. Some storage above here. Should be some storage under your bed, I'm guessing. Yep, it just doesn't have that spring to hold it up. So let's see if I'm strong. Oh, tons. And you can access, I like it when you can access your outside storage from the inside. Beautiful. Another big advantage to this one is this closet. You don't get that much hanging space in small campers, generally speaking, or just general storage space. And the bathroom is pretty standard, big tub, super clean. So this is the way they traded it in, you guys. We don't clean them until they're sold, which is kind of backwards, I know, but that's the way we do it. The advantage to that is you can see that they pretty much took good care of it because this is how they brought her in. So I will see you here shortly, evidently. And we'll go from there. It's 10 inches longer than what we wanted, but that's fine. It's the right weight. It's pre-owned, it's priced right. Let's go camping. <laughs> 